as you can see this works perfectly this is awesome hey what's up guys I'm Shubhan Kadeh from TechCrunch Gadgets and welcome to another video in this video I'm going to show you how you can install any Windows operating system on your Android device without root easily you can install Windows 10, Windows XP, Windows 95, Windows 8, Windows 8.1 also. This works with all versions of Windows and it's totally easy. So let's begin. If it is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to never miss any updates. Now let's back to the video. First, you need to go to the Play Store and search for an app named Limbo. Limbo is a PC emulator that lets you run any Windows operating system on your Android. It can be either Windows 10, Windows XP, Windows 95, Windows 8 or Windows 8.1. So just install it. Accept. You have to open it up for the first time to make it show it up on the directory. Acknowledge. Okay. Okay. This is Limbo. Now what you need to do is you have to go to the video description below and there you can find links for Windows 10, Windows XP, Windows 95 and Windows 8.1 and 8.1 operating systems respectively. Now you can download any of the Windows operating system you like, it's an image or it can be an ISO file. I have downloaded Windows XP because Windows 10 and Windows 8.1 files are very large around 1.1 GB. So to show you easily I have downloaded Windows XP file. Now what you need to do is you have to click on it and you have to copy or move it to limbo folder in your internal storage directory it is here and now you have to just paste it it will take a few seconds depending on your device as you can see I've pasted my Windows XP image file to the directory after that go to the limbo app and under load machine choose new you can name it anything you like for example I'll name it XP create and under user interface choose SDL and under architecture make sure you choose cross 86 because cross 64 will not work and it might crash and under CPU model choose QME32 and under CPU cores make sure you choose one because it's Windows XP and under RAM, I prefer you should choose uh, around 512 megabytes. You can also choose 960 megabytes or one, around 1 gigabyte. But because I have only 3 gigabytes of RAM on my Moto G4 Plus, I am choosing 512 megabytes. The graphics will not be that good. But you can understand it's an Android device so it will work properly. Now under the hard drive, click to enable it and click on none to choose open. Go to your internal storage to select the Windows XP file under Limbo. Here you can see the Limbo folder. Now you have to choose the Windows XP file or the other Windows operating system that you downloaded. Click on Windows XP.image. Again under CD-ROM, click to enable it and under None, click on Open. And again choose the Windows XP.image file. Now under VGA display, you need to choose STD. Under South card, you can uh, set it to none or if you want to select an uh, sound card you can choose SB16. I'll prefer to beat none. You don't need to change any of these settings. Under boot from device choose hard disk and you don't need to mess with these settings. Let it be like it was. Now click on full screen and high priority. Okay. And now under orientation click on landscape. That's it. You are done. So make sure everything is set properly and just now click on the play button. As you can see it has started Windows normally, mouse trackpad enabled. It will take some time to load. As you can see it is working, it's showing Windows XP Professional. This works great. It will take a few minutes to load. I'll skip it to the end part. Windows is starting up. Now you can use and customize Windows any way you like. So guys, this is it. In this way, you can enjoy Windows on your Android. Also note, if you can't install Windows 8, 8.1 or Windows 10 properly on your Android device, make sure you tweak around with the Limbo settings 
so that you can run it. And so guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button below and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more helpful videos like this. Thanks for watching again and I hope to see you again in the next video. Have a great day.